Alexa, play some Fred again on my Spotify. I can't find songs by Fred on Spotify. Alexa, play some Fred again on my Spotify. Why do you have to talk to them like that? I can't find songs by Fred on Spotify. Oh my god. Alexa, please play songs by Fred again on my Spotify. This is Fred again. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. Anyone sneezing since it's been warm again? Whoa. So I'm about to change uh, the bed sheets. I've got Luke staying tonight. You guys know Luke. You've met him before. So I'm gonna change the bed sheets and just freshen up the flat. Um, but it's really, really warm. And if I was to film it, I would have to get dressed. So I'm currently stood in my apartment with no clothes on and I'm not prepared to get dressed. So I'll see you guys in a bit, yeah? <laughs> Back here again. Music means a lot to me, right? Let me, let me. How's that? Is that better? That's better, isn't it? I'm gonna stay here. Music means a lot to me, right? Like, a lot. It's hard to explain, but it has such a massive effect on me, my overall mood, how I'm feeling, how I'm acting, everything. It can change fast, quick time, right? Maybe a little bit too much, I, I would argue at times. It massively, massively affects me. If I am really feeling down, I can put on some Fred again, and honestly, I will feel better. I will scream out the window, Fred again, especially all the way up here, right? It, like since living here, the amount of times I just scream out the window to make myself feel better, as daft as that sounds. Not scream like, ah, like scream like happy singing or, or something along those lines, you know? And a massive part of that whole music thing for me is Fred again, right? And this entire video is dedicated to my boy Fred, um, because I've seen him twice this week. I use his songs a lot in my videos, which one is not great because I can't monetize them, but I'd rather make a better video that has more meaning and more feeling for me deep inside my soul, you know? God, this is cringe. I'd rather do that than make a few quid off of a video, you know? That is what I have been doing for pretty much this entire year. Since I went to America, there was a massive, massive Fred Again dominance in my videos. Um, pretty much every Alphaland video had a Fred Again song in it. Um, you know, just, just stuff like that. I, I do things like that because that's what I resonate with and that's what I feel at that point in time. So today, we're gonna discuss how we managed to go see him twice. We're gonna talk about how it made me feel, how it changed my mood currently on today, how it changed my mood on the other days as well. It's gonna be a good one. Well, let's fucking go. All the content that I make now is very therapeutic for me. Um, like today, I've had a very long, quite stressful day at a bodybuilding show, right? And I got home with still so much to do. This is my 10 minute break in between when I've got to edit stuff, right? I still got so much to do. And I was just thinking, oh my God, like what am I gonna do? Where do I even start? Well, putting on Fred again for a few minutes and Yes, screaming out the window really, really helped me. Um, Why is that? Fred exploded, well not exploded, Fred kind of became apparent in my life um, during lockdown, which obviously was a very difficult time. I don't need to go into the specifics as to why, 
but it was for lots of people, including myself. Um, I was very, very fortunate to have the home gym at that point in time. So because of that, I could maintain, if you like, that kind of portion um, of my life, training and all that kind of stuff. What happens at a home gym? Well, you have control of the speakers, do you not? Yes, you do. So I put on Fred and I would train um, every day. And it just really became a thing. And that, in a nutshell, is why I have such a strong attachment to F Fred himself and his, his music as well. Um, it got me through a tough time, right? I didn't really tell anyone or, or like, it didn't, I wasn't like, oh my God, I love this guy Fred again. I put him on in the gym every day. Like, I just did. And it just became a thing. All of a sudden, I would just be dancing around the gym mid-lockdown going, we've lost dancing. You know, like, it was, it was just really, really good. And there I was in my hotel room in America going, pull me out of this. So I've been a fan of Fred ever since then. Before he was big, you know, like one of those people that says, oh, I love so-and-so before they got big. Like, that's kind of the truth for me, for Fred, really. So listening to him on days like this, um, when I need a little bit of a pick-me-up to kind of keep me going and get me through the rest of the day, music, for me, is r really that powerful tool, and in particular, Fred's music will get me through pretty much anything. You know, I will bob along, and I will, I will sing, and I will just... M my mood will just be elevated, you know? But something like this... My God, it's nothing compared to seeing him live, which I was fortunate enough to do twice this week. Like, you know, this is Vienna. Oh God, I love it so, so much. So I actually wound up going with a few people that I'd never met before. Hold on, let me rephrase that. I knew Claudia and then I went with Claudia's friends. Yes. And said friends I had never met. Yes. There we go. Okay, that makes more sense. And it was f***ing unreal for the first 20 minutes. <laughs> Long story short, we missed half of Monday, right? And by we, I mean myself and Claudia. Claudia didn't feel very well. We went outside, had to, like, she, she wasn't feeling great, right? We had to go out and sit outside, get some fresh air. It was so hot in there, like, so, so hot in there. It's 30 degrees in the UK here at the minute. Long story short, we missed a lot of the Monday gig. Um, and luckily, we managed to get ourselves tickets for the Tuesday as well to kind of make up for it. So we actually got to go twice, which was, Pretty cool. Well, one and a half times, I guess. <laughs> For the first time, I felt like I was in a room full of people that loved that same music as me as much as I did. Um, I doubt it, to be honest. There's not many people that, that... I'm a massive, massive Fred fan, right? There's not many people that like it as much as me, but I'm sure there were plenty of people that do, you know? I will at some point make a separate kind of video about all of my kind of experiences. Um, perhaps going into why a little bit more, but I'm just going into how it can kind of help me and maybe how finding something similar to that can, can kind of help you, you know? So it was the first time that I felt like I was in a room full of people that felt the same way. Kind of like an expo, like a body power or like a, a just an, a, an event, right? And it was great. And just experiences like this now more so I feel like I've always been appreciative of them but now more so than than ever I feel like you, it kind of comes with with age you know um, I just appreciate it so so much I was just there and just happy to be there like these guys that didn't know me at all probably just heard weird things from Claudia like I was just there stood there at times like not even singing I was just there like <sighs> Just, just happy, like stood dead still, just staring at it, you know? Fucking phenomenal. 
that feeling is like nothing else and getting to share it with people that you love it's awesome you know it's really really cool so Fred thank you for getting me through a very tough time you have no idea one day I will get to shake your hand and say thank you I have promised myself that that will be the case until that day I look forward to the new tracks coming out in the very near future play new track <laughs> So I suppose we will round this video off by saying try and find that little something that, whatever that is for you, right? For me, it is listening to, in particular, Fred's music. There's lots of people that I could bring into that equation, but in, in this moment right now, very much so Fred again. Um, whether it's reading a book, whether it's talking to a friend, whether it's just going for a walk, a bike ride, find that little something that can give you that little boost right because i really really needed that today not that today was a bad day today was a fucking fantastic day i'm just knackered right so i needed it i've listened to some fred i've talked to you guys i'm going to go and edit some photos then i'm going to edit this then i'm going to upload this and then i'm going to edit some more photos and then tomorrow we're going to do it all over again yes oh i love it and i'm staring at the sickest view coolest view in birmingham this I don't care what anyone says. Right, I've rambled about Fred enough. Are you still watching? If you are, you must be an absolute freaking legend. So what I'm gonna do is let you know that it is my proteins impact week. That means that you can get 45% off everything using code LSJ at checkout. It's 45% as a minimum actually, it's up to 80% off the entire store. Massive TikTok shop discounts right now, massive website discounts, so you use either or, whatever you find it cheaper on, just, just go through my link or my TikTok page or whatever, you know? Thank you all so much for watching. Thank you all so much for being here. I appreciate you all. Together, we will grow. I'm going to go and sing some more Fred while I upload some stuff. And I'll see you in the next one. So blessed. You can tell him what you must do. I just know that it gets better with time. I just know that. Live life like nobody is watching, ladies and gentlemen. Just know that it gets better with time. And then upload it to the internet. Okay. <laughs>